bio-misuses.info slash open hyphen letter. Dear Madam, Sir, I write to inform you about widespread misuses of modern biotechnologies by the intelligence agencies of today's major powers and in counteraction of a coalition of third world countries and worldwide operating private, independent defense leagues. Introduction page 1. Political Constellation 2. Enforcement Concepts 2. Command Centers 4. System of Labor Camps 4. Power Plots 11. Summary 12. Introduction. The The United States CIA investigates from the late 40 IES in its biochemical laboratories systematically naturally found venoms and synthesized toxins for their incisive effects, drawing also on exotic plants and animals, voodoo rites, and pseudo-medical experiments in Nazi concentration camps. They scaled up their R&D efforts in the 50 IES rapidly and synthesized new classes of toxins, in goal depraved and outlaw to affect every physiological, neurological, and genetic function of the human body and also of animal and plant life. Concurring with the United States military and NATO they developed an arsenal of non-conventional non-lethal to lethal bio, chem, and rad tech weapons in modernization of national defense in the battlefields of growing importance, information, psychology, physiology, genetics, ecology, and climate. In one project with a multitude of sub-projects they researched the anatomy and neurology with coded bioneuroactive electromagnetic fields of the central and peripheral nervous systems in intentional misapplication of neurological technologies to manipulate biochemical electrical processes, determining spiritual, ethical, social, intellectual, motivational, emotional, sensual, motoric and sexual behavior. Another large project researches structures and mechanisms of the human genome, in intentional misapplication of mutagenic, hybridization, and recombinant DNA technologies to cause with incisions into the genotype changes in the phenotype and shifts in the human gene pool. As goal has been set up the construction of the first biological bomb with peacetime application of blanket mass poisoning of food and water supplies with gene-altering agents and graded mass control of individual psychological, physiological, neurological, and genetic processes of their own and foreign populations. Present state-of-the-art technology with a program of systematically planted non-genetic toxins manipulates political social profiles of more than a hundred million people of all groups of society a year worldwide. One PDF printout home. Political constellation. Driving forces of the United States and NATO weapon research, development, testing, and employment are a formal representative position of constitutional democracy, human rights, and freedoms. B ideological position of hegemonic policies for gain by controlling global power networks with free access to resources, advantageous terms of trade, international division of labor, dominance in science and technology, global military intelligence superiority and vital national economic base. c. Policy directives by a complex of political, military, intelligence, research, industrial elites. d growing global importance of the, the United States in politics and all professional fields after WWI. E. Continuation of warfare from WWI to World War II to the Cold War to the present anti-terror war. F. History of massive, arbitrary human rights violations and non-compliance with international human rights laws. The United States hegemonic policies are stated as secret policy goals by a planning group of the National Security Council for Theater and Political Social Psychological Physical Operations on a global scale and authorized by executive order, though they are violations against the consent of the governed, constitutional standards and international conventions, e.g. technological superiority of military forces, intelligence, and homeland security agencies, aggressive weapon R&D programs, monopoly. In key security technologies, control structure over major R&D programs, a credible deterrence with ABCM weapons for multiple overkill, a worldwide presence of forces, massive use of force doctrine, surveillance of the information flow in its entirety, censorship of all public media, control over political religious economic social structures and processes, manipulation of individual psychological profiles and in planning of demographic structures of entire populations. Secret policy goals are realized today by more than 50,000 black projects of research, testing, and application, 40% of the, the United States military budget with total secrecy, insured by command centers with a system of labor camps. A clandestine constitutional revolution by misapplied power of the political defense elites has established a militantly nationalist state, upheld by image fascism, tools of deception are enforced with tools of violence. A coalition of the majority of third world countries, supported by Russia, and several larger, 
private parties and independent defense leagues investigated the security agencies of the Western Atomic Powers and NATO, of Russia, Japan, Germany, Israel, and Saudi Arabia, retrieved their technological know-how, plundered operational equipment, duplicated the command centers and escalated under an apparently calm surface these clandestine op rations into a global dirty high-tech war between all existing and new emerging groups. Main goals are predominance in bio, chem, and rad tech tools, suppression of any attempt towards publication of undercover methods, revenge for torture and murder, for the third world political military economic social counter leverage against the western powers, revenge for 500 years of dehumanizing treatment and indignation to lay waste depraved political social leadership. Enforcement Concepts the global agenda of long-term political bloc securement, control, and expansion is enforced across collective political reality, collective social reality and individual political social behavior. Priority of security planning over national, general public interests, as those find a balance in democratic processes through social weights and public discussion of issues, is achieved. Through representation in security panels of the legislative, judicative, administrative departments, political parties, commercial security, through public relation campaigns, justifying security apparatus and armament programs, a policy of national security in all facets of life and total political social control. 2. Priority of security planning over international, general public interests of the community of nations is achieved through a global system of client states in continuing, collaborating coordination of interests. Their professional political social cultural decision making elites are established in office by information, reorientation, cooperation, education, leadership training, incentive, and covered financial aid programs in transatlantic and Pacific partnerships, a mutually reinforcing diplomatic personnel network. Eliminated our oppositional elites. As facades held up our preserved etiquettes, traditions, political scientific economic social illusions like a constitutional framework, claimable basic freedoms, a welfare image of government institutions and raising of general public health. Added are illusions of human capabilities and convenience like mastery of nature and ever accelerating economic growth. Added are hypocritical ethical standards like public discussion of all issues with democratic mechanisms of conflict solving. Undercover intelligence operations are employed to safeguard collective realities and to determine individual political social behavior. The traditional goal to topple an adversary by subversion and corruption in collapse from within without outer force is replaced by covered activities with psychological technological means in all professional fields towards selfing, stable, comprehensive, manipulated public environment, opinion, and acting to enlist them as pliable auxiliaries in a global political social system. Total secrecy requires a gapless early warning system against security threats to cut short any arising attempt towards publication of the employment of undercover methods or of a target's medical or legal evidence. An intelligence review panel has power over life and death. Programmed by clandestine technological means is a high degree of political uniformity, a consuming, non-questioning, non-probing, non-knowing conformity. A population remains in its behavior illusion guided as it is bare of convictions, ethics, reason, maturity, real life experience with legal means of defense. Public opinion is restricted to acceptable ideological messages, eliminated our critical voices from public representatives, cultural institutions, relief organizations, watchdog organizations, whistleblowers, dissidents, alternate media. Technologies are the practical means to realize policy directives. The, the United States and NATO are the leading global researchers with dominance in the sciences and applications. Modern technologies extend the radius of human action microscopically to globally to macroscopically, over ages and with malign use to planetary catastrophes. Weaponizing of modern technologies, progressively easier, faster, more frequent and severe hitting than foregone ones, can lead to global pollution, climatic collapse, devastation of natural land, destruction of build land for hundreds of years and eradication of billions of people with possible extinction of mankind. US slash NATO research panels of the military, intelligence and security agencies develop the arsenal of compact weapon architectures over the spectrum of conflicts out of an array of large-scale research programs, e.g. Defense Advanced Research Projects, DARP, which are funded, spread out, outsourced, tested, set up for operation, departmentalized and in institutionalized. They are to exhaust human material, scientific technological capabilities in space, in air, at sea, at land from single to large scale, non-lethal to lethal, intercepting to blocking to retaliating tools, 
mainly in misuses of physics, chemistry, biology, genetics, medicine, and computer science. Crime out of the most advanced technology corrupts in first-line basic human living conditions as it cannot be perceived by the senses in the very small, very distant and difficult to detect. Taken advantage of is the vulnerability of man in his physiological constitution against traces of natural and synthesized germs, viruses, toxins, and also hostile natural and social environments. Toxins can be e.g. contaminants, biochemical agents, electrical current, electromagnetic thermal optical acoustic wave particle radiation, neurologically coded misinformation and mechanically operating nano devices. New classes of microweapons and toxins, their technology the key to power in the 21st century, manipulating physiological, neurological and genetic functions, cripple mostly man's inner freedoms of thought and movement. 3. Command Centers High-tech command centers within security bases e.g. the United States Special Operational Command, SOC, supervise production lines of the toxins, storage, delivery, and set-off systems, a global satellite telecommunication and surveillance system, a global network of operatives and covered operations. The data gathered are stored and evaluated by advanced nanotechnology data processing equipment. The, the United States NSA EG employs over 50.000 administrators, analysts, scientists, technicians, and operatives nationwide. Poison dispensers in form microscopically tiny pellets, containing toxins in gelatin skin, microchip, receiver, emitter, nanorobot, tiny listening and video devices and biochemical electrical thermal genetic sensors are produced by the millions in microchip precision engineering. As depot poison pellets they are implanted directly or placed on a carrier like an unknowing person or any object of daily use or a drink water reservoir or any stage of the food chain or a space-based gliding probe flying drone device to be electronically guided into the vicinity of the target. They can be spun off several times out of multiple layers of equally tiny hair like pneumatic guns with an effective range of about 30 feet to be shot in. Nobots channel the pellets into site-specific body tissue. They are applied single and massive, graded and blanket, narrow and wide, random and selective, scattered and systematic, limited and open-ended, enclosed and open mediums, contained and epidemic, preparatory and acute and are set off electronically, time-locked, by a pre-programmed code signal or sound or voice or within body tissue by toxin concentration or neurological process recognition. The security agencies of the Western powers enforce political conformity in their countries with international intelligence agreements, e.g. information sharing and division of labor. Drawing on total information control, the CIA-FBI, the British and French Secret Service and the German BND-AVS Channel government personnel, within their populations at large groups perceived as dissidents like sympathizers of opposite ideological camps. Military intelligence channels military personnel, within the population groups like anti-war activists and draft resistors. The security organizations of Western industries channel management personnel, within the population work ethics and economic behavior. Global system of labor camps. Today the enforcement operations of all parties comprise a worldwide system of labor camps. 1. Extermination camps, executioners eliminate more than 1,000 people a year. 2. Gas chambers, hit teams spray with concentrated nerve gases thousands of people a year. 3. Radiation camps, hit teams crippled by wave particle beams thousands of people a year. 4. Labor camps of sadism and sodomy, hit teams execute a billion druggings a year. 5. Labor camps of behavior manipulation, hit teams mass drug millions of people a year. 6. Labor camps of subversion, agents commit gross human rights violations around the world. 7. Dissection camps, hit teams test new toxins like genetic agents on millions of people a year. 8. Labor camps of deception, spies record in total information control hundreds of billions of conversations, objects like buildings, equipment, and documents, electronic data, individual brainwave patterns, genetic fingerprints, and physiological processes by electronic means per day. Nine. Propagating the total lie, in the name of humanity they suppress publication of the unleashing of multiple, uncontrolled dangers of the extinction of mankind. 4. 1. There is not one major security agency around the world that does not have its killing fields. Also the military security department of NATO operates an assassination squad to eliminate terrorists, who are intercepted in preparations, foreign agents, who penetrate security areas. Traders, who sell security information, deserters, who are caught up with behind hostile lines, security risks, 
who threaten to impair personnel and operations and critics, who become a formidable voice in public. The assassinations are priority operations, well organized and quiet. A small intelligence court reviews the evidence, the target is pumped up with depot poison pellets, sent to or caught up in a remote area, death follows in a breakdown or an accident, a death certificate is issued, citing an apparent natural cause of death. Where isolation of the target is not possible, it is incapacitated, discredited, and eliminated by a terminal disease like cancer. Uncovered foreign operatives and own double agents for example by NATO are hung up at backwards crossed arms over a wall urinal in a basement of a remote station to be tortured by mechanical, electrical, radiative and biochemical means like CIA psycho and sodomy drugs for 2-8 days. The victim is dead, when all body fluids stop dripping. 2. Four gas chambers targeted are mainly people, working with the mind and propagating ideologically not acceptable messages like leadership of an oppositional movement, dissenting journalists, lawyers, doctors, scientists, and artists. Military nerve gases attack specific functions of the central nervous system like wake awareness, memory, concentration, reaction, coordination, and balance, the peripheral nervous system with loss of physical power, agility, and flexibility. Industrial toxic gases often are carcinogens, reducing the pulmonary system, physiological functions, and inducing tumorous growth in the long term. In the basement of the dignity of man with spiritual gifts, crippled our intellectual UND physical strengths to the point of disability to perform tasks of everyday life. From cartridges gassed our entire streets, buildings, trains, buses, cars, assembly halls, and swimming pools. Nerve gas pellets are attached to any object of daily use like packaging, newspapers, books, clothing and tools, the set-off signal time for maximum toxic concentration at time of exposure. The target's home is laced mostly with by odor imperceptible dosages for long-term effects, if not the bedroom itself is used as death chamber. H. Colin B. Netanyahu operated gas chambers in churches and near the sites of former Nazi consent ration camps. 3. Radiation camps entrap terrorists, insurgents, border influx, secret bearers like scientists of security technologies, most wanted persons and crowds for riot control or fabrication. Utilized our lasers with a beam of light and heat, microwave emitters with electromagnetic beams, sound emitters with acoustic waves, particle generators with subatomic and atomic particle beams and radioactive contaminants with alpha dash, beta, and gamma radiation. They are adjusted in intensity, wavelength, and frequency, pulse duration, pulse pattern and spot size. Targets are by their biophysiological neurological electromagnetic fields over a distance at the speed of light wirelessly without implant found, spot pointed, identified, tracked, brain linked read, misinformed, behavior manipulated, tortured with pain and evoke sensations, emotions, thoughts, and non to lethally in selected physiological functions incapacitated. Equipment is electronically read, disrupted, fractured, burned out and molten. Human computer symbiosis by a microchip implant in the brain for a neurobiological to data processing interface e.g. facilitates command center to soldier observation, communication, and reaction, serves as interrogation tool of prisoners and assists captive soldiers not to yield to interrogative pressures. Civilian applications are in all fields of communication. 5. 4. Targeted for labor camps of sadism and sodomy are groups of activists like human rights workers in defense of unpopular causes, critical voices of the political system, the press, and free market, environmentalists, radical groups of minorities, groups of politically disruptive citizens like whistleblowers of corruption affairs, paparazzi of private scandals, bloggers of alternate media, groups of security risks like soldiers, who dropped out for second thoughts, defectors from opposite ideological camps, groups of deviants like pacifists and dropouts from the rat race, groups of people of faith, conviction, culture, and achievements. Preliminary stages, often a field for trainees, are 24-7-52 surveillance, targeting, tracking, vehicular stalking, harassment, smearing, slander, intimidation, alienation, discrimination, covered entry, tampering with records, cyber stalking, infection of the computer, defrauding, entrapment, wrongful commitment to a mental institution, unlawful arrest, and imprisonment. Induced sexual states, in chemical rape at any place or in the privacy of the home, the target's mental, motivational, emotional, and physical capacities are reduced by blocking agents and a variety of sodomy drugs manipulate in succession sexual drive, erotic sensations, sensibility of genital parts, secretion of sweat glands, speed, endurance, exhaustion, sleep, 
dream, hangover. Drug-induced fixed mental images of perversity acts direct physical activities, while erotic stimulants have often been individually designed according to previously taken brainwave mappings. The offspring is being monitored in its mental, psychological, and physical development. Induced physical states, bodily strength is reduced to consistent drop in your tracks fatigue with pain in the limbs and restriction of movements, added by sleep inhibitors and aging accelerators. Manipulated sensations range from super relaxation to hypertension. Induced emotional states, biochemically directed is every emotion from anticipation to contentedness, from blind hope to despair, from elation to anger, from boldness to fear, in state from hypersensitivity to insensitivity. A joy of death frenzy can supplant every agony of torture. Induced mental states, in psychological terror the mental functions of consciousness, intention, conception, memory, and operation are depressed, stimulated or distorted to the point of non-resistance against adversities, hardships, and threats. Function-specific toxins block abstract reasoning, cause language blackout, computation blackout, memory blackout, and manipulate specific mental interests. Stimulation towards blasphemy of the Holy Spirit is achieved by boosters of fixed, eccentric theological themes and a desire to communicate. Unremittingly, periodically manipulated are several neurological physiological processes to extremes, e.g. to seizure, hallucination, and delirium, not to allow relaxation and to lead to disintegration. In all the target's personal development, identity, character, especially its political ethical standards, are worn out, debased and suffocated in the suds of prostitution to cause traumatization, irrational behavior, self-destructive habits, and personality breakdown. The victim, often with a depot poison pellet induced sterilization, exacerbated pre-existing or creeping disease like tumorous growth in the genitals, is in its professional work blocked, on the social level isolated, disenfranchised, from welfare and family safety net severed and diagnosed with a mental illness. It is to die on the streets. Hit teams mass drug entire water and food supplies for years from the start of the food chain to the selected target, at agricultural producers and suppliers, in the food processing industry, at distributors, supermarkets, restaurants, the target's home and in transport via repackaging resealing facilities. Contaminated with toxins, taken up with skin contact, are objects of daily use like first aid supplies, hygiene articles, textiles, and dryers. Labor camps of sadism and sodomy, having become widespread government, corporate and private security operations, have been set up around the world and are blanketing with sodomy drugs entire regions, ethnic groups, and political fractions. The United States stay behind armies in former occupied territories have systematically targeted in Germany after World War II anti the United States, anti Cold War activists and in Panama after the invasion of 1989 supporters of General Noriega. 6. 5. Targeted for labor camps of behavior manipulation are mostly government and corporate personnel and the population at large. In first place individual behavior is suppressed or stimulated in its elementary physical needs, in exercise and sleep requirements appetite and thirst, hygiene, and beauty care. In second place the emotional state is manipulated from thrift to the urge to go shopping and from stress, frustration to the desire to achieve social recognition up to power madness. In third place affected is motivation, capped to the state of lethargy or boosted into go on efforts in face of exhaustion or failure. In fourth place intellectual interests are selectively stimulated or reduced, while mental and ethical awareness are dampened to the point of unscrupulousness. The toxins are administered mostly in small dosages, depot time released to cause habit-forming economic behavior patterns. Social behavior like cooperation in teams, groups, hierarchical structures, and manners of communication is manipulated out of the emotional state from diffidence to hostility, out of channeled motivation from dropping out to intriguing, through inducement of nervousness, through disruption of fine motoric ingestures and impairment of the vocal cords. In all the target's physical fitness, personal development, Education, professional and social careers are predetermined. Exxon e.g. stabilizes plant employees and their families for reliable long-term work performance. 6. Labor camps of subversion are set up in foreign countries. With friendly allies, who are regarded as reliable political partners, mutual interests are regulated by bi- and multilateral cooperation agreements. However, a government intelligence agency promotes its secret policy goal of global dominance in any nation through direct leverage for political military security interventions, access to open markets and free flow of information, 
wash out of cultural identity, subversion, and corruption of the foreign political social structure by manipulation of the public press and inhibition of independent development of vital scientific, technological, economic and financial bases, fragmentation of political alliances, profit from their wars, in all dominance with foreign-sided dependencies, superiority by determination, own resources, means, mass, size and diversity. The intelligence, counter-intelligence, and security agencies' operational resources are scaled up to the required size to realize their secret policy directives. They employ official contacts, manipulation, forgery, theft, bribery, extortion, recruitment, counseling, financial sponsoring, partnerships, and takeovers, supported by home-based intelligence analyses. Sold are proprietary information, low-cost credits, logistical supplies, user rights, telecommunication systems, special technologies, tools of clandestine high-tech terror. Their first tools always remains the covered operation in all hazard areas with information gathering, detection, identification, tracking, gaining of access, operation of rendering safe, recovery, mitigation or neutralization, retreat, and exploitation and also spot, walk by, stalk, decoy and hit teams with a system of labor camps to control the broad base of the population and arising security risks. 7. For dissection camps selected as guinea pigs for non-consensual, illegal, covert, perverse life medical experiments, often with torture of deterring, degrading bestiality, are terrorist suspects, captured freedom fighters, perceived as terrorists, prisoners in undisclosed detention centers, prisoners in civilian jails, convicted of a heinous crime, tenacious dissidents for punitive action, the vulnerable like civilians in war-torn regions, minorities in technological underdeveloped areas. Suicidal persons, mental patients, the dying in nursing homes and intensive care wards, people considered to be expendable like uprooted individuals, loose prey, lone fighters, street people, life populations like in single and widely scattered real action simulations for statistical samples of medium, path, and speed of epidemic spread of agents. 7. Developed, tested in vivo and evaluated are new classes of radiation biochemical genetic toxins. As active agents in compact weapon architectures they undergo a military worth analysis for the weapon system concept, target vulnerability, operational engagement, and mission accomplishment by modeling, simulation, war game and life testing. Biochem genetic toxins for control over mind and body are screened with advanced analytical methods for their anatomical, physiological, neurological, psychological, pathological latent, present, and long-term effects over a broad scope, e.g. kind and degree of impairment, efficiency, selectivity of tissue-specific structure and function, dosages, incubation times, side effects, co-termining factors, counter-poisons, recuperation times, measurability, visibility and traceability. Toxins and sensors are surgically implanted by assisting medical personnel or are with a suitable carrier shot in by hit teams for modem-like entry. A series of microchip-based biochemical genetic electromagnetic thermal optical acoustic sensors and radio emitters with RFID technology are placed cell-specific into the body of the test object, the skull and all cortexes of the brain, e.g. the visual, hearing, verbal, thought, emotion and motoric regions to record neurological performance with e.g. sensual perceptions, mental operations, memory, moods, and behavior, are placed along nerve strands and their axons, other organs, glands, muscles skin, digestive tract, all parts of the male or female reproductive system to record physiological performance. In addition, the victim's environment is wired up with illegal listening and video devices. The data are collected via external amplifier and satellite directly at the security agency's high-tech command center for evaluation. Unwitting citizens are denied medical treatment. Medical tests return normal. Criminal charges are turned down for insufficient evidence. Reports in public are discredited and cut short. None of the guinea pigs are to recover and the death certificate shows an apparent natural cause of death. E.g. the governments of France and Israel developed their nerve gas programs with test series on FLN and Palestinian freedom fighters, taken prisoners, none survived and their ashes were scattered over the desert. Misuses of genetics In a global fornication race to gain predominance in all tools of clandestine high-tech terror, the major power security agencies press ahead with the development of biochemical mutagenic, hybridization, and recombinant DNA technologies to enable site-specific incisions into the gene pool population-wide. The present state-of-the-art techniques of behavior Chan Nelling is to be improved by degrees of efficiency, not symptoms but cause attacking, of coverage of regions and groups with stable, lasting results, 
transferring altered genetic strains to succeeding generations and of economy by centralized supervision of a lean network of undercover operatives. Genetic incisions affect directly the anatomy and physiology of an organism. Primarily manipulated is an elementary trait, where the phenotype with hereditary, morphological, or functional distinction is traced to a specific genotype and the individual gene or gene group as functional unit is identified with its biosynthetic pathway. Massive, population-wide genetic manipulations affect in first line the demographic structure. Genetic incisions to fix a specific trait in the public psychological profile stably, continuously, and time effectively will result due to the large number of variables, interdependencies and co-termining factors in an almost irreversible shift of frame in several allele frequencies of the world population's gene pool with uncontrollable, catastrophic side effects. 8. Aimed at our four levels of incision. Alpha, death through disablement of a vital function or through a morphological malformation. Beta, invalidity or disease through a mostly temporal, local, graded manipulation of a physiological function by e.g. activation, stimulation, depression, deactivation, alteration, dysfunction. Gamma, change in the level of a physiological, often neurological capacity. Delta, altered growth and differentiation of a specific capacity, mainly to predetermine the psychological profile. Predictable behavior programming is to be achieved through biochemical DNA manipulations. Following mainly. 7a, political criteria, a major powers National Security Council states the secret policy goal, control of all political social structures, processes, and individual psychological profiles by manipulation of neurological and genetic processes to render them within preset parameters long-term planable and short-term correctable. Population genetics with biochemical strain manipulations is employed as rational, scientific tool to model a population's allele composition. In a systematic, clandestine, monitored process of repetitively correcting and cataloging incisions, every individual of the target group is subject to strain manipulations. The allele distribution of the common gene pool is tailored to a design structure and frequency by means of introduction of desired and modification or elimination of undesired dominant and recessive traits. Individuals with genodeviant, substandard traits are eliminated. 7b, military criteria, according to the, the United States and NATO secret policy goal of technological superiority in all weapon categories, aimed at are the construction and peacetime employment of the first biological bomb. Its first stage comprises the genetic identification, marking and tracking of every single individual in every country by a network of undercover operatives and a satellite surveillance system. In the second stage every single individual is by manual or pneumatic means pumped up with depot poison pellets, containing genome-altering agents. The third stage, an electronic set-off mechanism, furnishes the capability of single and mass applications with selection of targets, grading of damages, fixing of place, time, and circumstances. The deployment structure comprises also a depot system of toxin lock capsules in water and food supplies, at high traffic locations of people and goods and space-based gliding probe flying drone devices. 7c, Economic Criteria, the economic structure is to be manipulated population-wide mainly through individual basic needs and motivation channeled behavior patterns to control the key economic indicators of e.g. net domestic product by kind of economic activity, private investments and consumption expenditures, net savings corporate and labor force structures, adherence to labor peace, work ethics, and productivity. 70. Sociological criteria, the social structure, especially the wider technological elite, is to be predetermined mainly through manipulation of basic traits of intellectual interests and capabilities as well as motivation, emotional state, and sexual behavior, channeling each person's personal development, education, identity, character, professional and social careers. 70 demographic criteria, genetic incisions, leading to individual imbalances and impairments, determine e.g. the rates of stillborn, life birth, infant mortality, disease, disability, invalidity and death and with it key population parameters, base of and leverage on social and economic structures like population size, local population density, age group distribution, growth trends, health standards, care and insurance and also further statistics like average work years, retirement age and Life expectancy. Indicators of general health according to registered causes and external factors like environmental effects have become insignificant. 9. 8. In labor camp of deception spies funnel illegal listening video devices into every household, work, and public place in the world. Every person is wired up with multi-sensors and electromagnetic signal transmitters to pursue him in all his prayers, 
travels, intellectual, professional and social activities throughout all phases of the day over a span of over 70 years up to his demise. Brainwave mappings decode e.g. visual images, formulation of thoughts and acoustic signals. Genetic fingerprints list the complete gene sequences of the chromosomes. Under close coverage, individuals are monitored with two-way computer-to-brain region signal transmission with flux invocation, maintenance, modification, and inhibition. Total information control comprises blanket, continuous, simultaneous, remote telemetric coverage of all objects like electronic equipment and individuals in any location at input, processing and output points via microchip devices, amplifiers, satellite, and ultra-fast high-capacity computers, utilizing most advanced information technology. First priority in a labor camp of deception is the establishment of a gapless early warning system against security threats to cut short meticulously any personnel and material traces of attempts towards publication of employment of undercover methods or of a target's medical or legal evidence. Press, medical and legal associations are coerced into a complicit, interlocked security network. Accepted are only mainstream ideological messages under false fronts. Everything else is cut out, especially shielded are black projects with their source of funding, critical voices are corrupted or distracted with induced fun images or attacked in their credibility and eliminated, disadvantageous public issues are defused, denied, and eradicated from public awareness. Human rights inquiries are not assisted from government offices, damages wrought by government offices is covered up, TV war reports of action with carnage is censored, a military confrontation is transformed into a foreign local intervention. In all, eliminated is the knowledgeable citizen, who thinks independently over the full spectrum of his mind. Done away with his oversight and legal protection by the people, civil authorities, the press, and Congress. The psychological underpinnings of society have become confusion, distrust, paranoia, cynicism, and perpetuated human rights abuses under a calm surface of strict formality. 9. Several private, independent defense leagues claim to clean up these crimes with establishment of internationally guaranteed safeguards against misuses of modern biotechnologies. In hypocritical perversion they do the opposite. They do not take one step to say a word in public. They lie about life, creation, causes of procreation and death. They do not hang up a poster to inform the general public. They do not file a public charge with a district attorney's office. They do not help a single victim with a doctor. They escalated their investigations into the security agencies of the Western powers into a global, dirty high-tech war between all factions, each against all, attacking the personnel of government security agencies, of competing and oppositional private security services and any hostile person, group, and population to gain predominance in bio, chem and rad tech weapons. In this fornication race they claim security through total information control with suppression of public, legal and medical evidence and bestial deterrence like in concentration camps. They tolerate the government security agencies planning, R&D, operations, and mass applications. They retrieved their technological know-how, plundered stockpiles, operational equipment, and copied the high-tech command centers to employ the widest variety of psycho and sodomy drugs and test any new, experimental drug directly on populations. They multiplied to several thousand groups, terrorist organizations according to German law, 129 ASTGB. Their motivations arise out of archaic notions of prestige, power, possessions, and pleasure, void of a human base alternating between the poles of illusions and bestialities and having reached the lowest bottom of moral depravity ever, they supervise the largest system of labor camps. Their executioners e.g. sodomize their adopted targets under psychological terror to death, while attaching a perversity label of emergency medical care for the victims with anonymously shot in poison pellets. 10. Power Plots Profit we make a profit from our labors. We employ our knowledge and skills. Recruiting into our corporation. Institutionalizing our social system. Prospering, LE system, same way. Privileges. We surf with the crest of waves. We enjoy unscathable privileges. Owing the media with her stories. Blue collars don't have any say. Spelling out, la realite, say plaisir. Persecution. Where shall we march from here? Where to shall we turn our attention? Persecute them and their children. Letting everything hang out below. Deciding, liberté to jurors. Perversities. Hit teams work with clandestine sciences. Turning their attention to monies earned. Poisoning slowly their eat, drink and wear. Stealing their perverse self, life, and future. Confirming, unite the logini allied. 
proof. Our trickeries are our Achilles heels. Sparrows in droves jostle on rooftops. Call with the voices of the slaughtered. We have no place to go. But to run for the ropes. 11. Summary. The private, independent defense leagues, having suppressed the publication of the horrifying human rights violations by the security agencies of the Western powers since their first investigations, a breeding ground for image fascism and despotic perversion, in consequence have fostered through the stages of subversion, corruption, fornication, duplication, expansion, proliferation, escalation a global high-tech war to shoot into gigantic proportions. The process has been stirred up by hate as an incitement to commit any sodomitic bestiality conceivable. Suffocated in the suds of prostitution are the integrities of truth and life, which give content to the dignity of man. It is the right of the people to reverse this clandestine constitutional revolution and to institute a new government with the principle of drawing power out of political social life, the most de vastating archaic notion, narrow, vile, hateful, persistent, scheming and instrumentalizing values for gain. However, in the outgoing decade of the last century, corruption, fornication, and extinction of mankind have become the predominant forces of history. Sincerely, Udo Frentzen, Van Vlaet Str. 13, 50858 Kerm, Germany. HTTP colon slash slash www.bio-misuses.info.